Yeah, for for Emma, forever ago. Um, is there a, an a, a Emma? Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, everybody, yeah. everybody has an Emma. Um, wh what the title means for me uh, of the record is that um, it's it's about somebody that that uh, I was in love with, and uh, and. It's a, it's but it is a bit metaphorical um, because it's not about us. It's not about one person. Um, it's about it's about me and about how a love I once had sort of sabotaged relationships I had after that. You know, up until recently, and uh, it's kind of like that's what the that's what the record's about is about my struggle with that sort of oldness and that sort of ancient memory and, and, and how that sort of becomes a statue in stone and it becomes hard and cold and kind of crumbles. And uh, that's, that's what, that, that's what the, the ammo part is. Yeah. Um, it's, it's kind of... And you need to get that, get that out of your system. Right? Yeah. That's you, what this album is. Exactly. And it's, a, it's alleviating that pain is, is what the record does for yeah. me. And, and why forever ago? That that's kind of like it's referring to like a period that period of time you know like that's that 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 that, that time in your life that's sort of ruled by this ancient power or or some, or pain or or you know loss or whatever you know those are really heavy words referring to something as simple as a relationship but you know those things are heavy in people's lives and they were yeah. had become so overgrown in sort of the front yard of my life that I I'd lost a track and, and really uh, had a tough time navigating um, through kind of everyday life because it was just kind of stunning and, and paralyzing. Yeah. And, and well, did it work? Uh, are you an, a different person now? Or I, I, I am. Have you, have you changed? Yeah. I have changed. I have changed. And it, it felt, uh, at first it felt a little, I felt a little bit uh, weary of saying that. Um, and maybe I've not changed into a new person, but maybe I've just shed a lot of skin, um, and maybe I'm I'm feeling a bit more normal and natural. But um, the, the thing that the thing that happened is that I, I freed a lot of things up, and, and I don't feel like I, I made some huge realization. I wanted to be careful of making some huge realization, and then being like, oh. I'm all better now. Great going. Uh, I was worried worried about that because that had happened before. You know, like all right, I'm I'm fine. Just day one of new life, go, yeah. and uh, that just doesn't happen. But uh, through time and uh, and reflection of the of the basically that time that I spent at that cabin, um, I realized that by doing that, it really helped me get to where I needed to be to be a happy person, to be happier, and to kind of cultivate that happiness in my life. Yeah. Uh, like get to know you because uh, you know get to know yourself. Exactly. Right? Exactly. So, uh, get this back. is what I am and uh, yeah. You're right. You're right. Yeah.